Hey guys, welcome to another edition of An Engineer's Opinion. This time I'm going to be talking about the recently cancelled LG Watch Urbane. So let's jump over to the article here. So there's an article from ours, but it originated from Android Police, so we'll go there and we'll link them. It's their story, so let's give them the credit. So right here uh, we can see that LG has given a statement that there is a hardware issue that affects the day-to-day -day functionality of the device and after they checked it out they probably explored all possible solutions all possible ways to fix it all ways to uh, mitigate it and it's apparently a pretty big issue because they just completely canceled the rollout and a couple of the headlines say indefinitely canceled I think these guys say indefinitely um, it's not really clear if they'll bring it back with like a rev 2 but it's dead for now it's been out for a couple days some people have them and most people have said that it's working just fine so the thing that hasn't happened yet is the Verizon rollout only AT&T people have them right now so a lot of people are speculating that it's something to do with the Verizon towers and that could be so day-to-day -day operation means something they're expecting you to use every day so it's either going to be the battery the processor or the coverage it gets and if it's the battery or the processor the people with AT&T should have seen it by now but because they haven't reported any problems there hasn't been some crazy thing like oh it you know the smoke came out of it and you release the magic smoke that's never good you can't put that back in there but no one's reported any problems that I've seen so it's probably something to do with the Verizon towers or it's something to where after the vice has been on for a couple hours now it's dead so if they've just been aware of it these devices that they're probably finding it on have probably been the long-term tester units which has been on for several months now and so if there's some uh, chip bacon problem so the silicone's heating up and whatever glue they've been using could be interacting with the flux on their boards I've seen this before and ICs could start popping up those integrated components or integrated circuits sorry so they could start popping up and it could just start breaking it could have intermittent power on problems it could have charging issues but we don't really know and we're probably never going to know. LG's probably not going to tell us because they don't really have to. So if you want to take a risk, you can try and find one. They're going to be pretty expensive. But otherwise, yeah, wait for the next watch. That's an engineer's opinion.